Mason looking, looking, back of the end zone throw, caught! Haywood, touchdown Idaho! season and Hightower couldn't have played it any better. A big hit that time by Caden Ellis. And the Vandals are going to come up with a victory here. An impressive win here at home, 31 to 12. That was the best intensity and the best fire we've had yet. And a couple guys took it upon themselves to make sure it was that way. Go from here. This is where we were right in that game. <laughs> Let's be here by Saturday afternoon when we play that game. And then let's go out and just play our hearts out. Because through the first half, probably middle of the third quarter, we as good a football team as there is. Play. We play just like we played the whole first half, first part of that third quarter, the whole game, and we'll go get a win. <coughs> and that's what we're going to go do. Does everybody got me? Yes, sir. Let's go. Man for nine. Hey, man. Hey, man. Live from D. Willie 6th Street Tap and Grill in downtown Moscow, this is the Paul Petrino Radio Show. Has your team played a better half of football than you guys did in the first half? There's no question that was one of the best halves of football we played. and Everybody played really well and executed well in all three phases. Why? Well, I think that you've, you've really seen us improve the last couple of weeks. I think we played a lot better at Montana State. Um, we just didn't quite take the next step. And then I think we had a good week of practice, continued to improve. And, and so if, if you can just keep doing that, then you usually can play your best football at the end of the year. Everyone in this room, let's have a goal right now. That's going to be the best game to play yet. I hope that. Everybody got me? Yes, sir. Everyone in here, let's make that happen. And then we'll go have fun and have a great day. Um, let's talk a little bit about Eastern Washington specifically. How intense can this rivalry be the first year that we're playing it? Um, I, I hopefully really intense. Hopefully it's a heck of a game and a close game. And both teams are battling, and that's how rivalries kind of get started. I mean, you don't necessarily have to be a rivalry to have a great intense game, you know, and so hopefully this first game is um, both teams go out there and play with great passion and are physical and tough. and and uh, we find a way to win in the fourth quarter. And then I think from there is when the rivalry start building more and more. Go against each other each year and they're hard fought games and, and that's how you build a rivalry. That's how you, that's how you come to dislike each other and, and you play hard, fought, physical, tough games. And that's, that's how it starts. And obviously with two schools 80 miles apart, that, that's just going to be something that's going to build naturally, right? Correct. I mean, it's right up the road, so hopefully we'll have all kinds of fans there, and it'll be a, be a great crowd, and we'll have a lot of people you know, cheering for us. And I think that's part of building the rivalry, you know, when you have, when the fans believe it's a rivalry, and they make it a rivalry. I think that helps. As close as we both are, you know, I, I, I would assume it'll become a real big rivalry. We're going to stay here in Moscow, we're going to get up Saturday morning, we're going to drive up there and get a win and come home. Okay? So just be like keeping our own winning streak alive. We just have to play on a red turf instead of here. What do you need to see this weekend? I need to see our guys go out there and just compete their tails off and play with great passion and toughness. And just, uh, all 11 guys on all three phases play as hard as they can every single play. Thanks for being here. Uh, good Thanks. luck on Saturday. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. All right, that's Paul Petrino joining us live from D. Willie 6th Street Tap and Grill. We're on the air on Saturday at 11 o'clock Pacific time in the morning with a pregame show, 12 o'clock Mountain. Kickoff one hour later, noon Pacific, 1 o'clock Mountain time, live from Eastern Washington. Hope you can join us for the rivalry between the Eagles and the Vandals.
you're a second year student do you kind of know what you want to do after football's over or are you still figuring that out uh, i think i kind of know what i'm doing i think i want to like um to get my own business i'm busy in marketing so i want to make my own business have my own clothes so you probably could wear my clothes when you me yeah uh, I, I, I don't know about that i'm not i'm not i'm not exactly the the uh, model type, if you know what I'm talking about. You got, you got, you're gonna make clothes for old dumpy guys. Is that what you're gonna do? If you like wearing sweatsuits, then yeah. 